Welcome everybody to Track and Field Infinite. In today's video, I'm going to be going over how you can become a noob to a pro. So in this video, if you do end up watching all the way until the end, you will basically just become a pro with a tip. So I'm going to be showing you. This is a guide video showing you how to become a pro. So first things first guys, what I highly recommend you watching is this. So I did do a video showing you guys how to run quicker. I highly recommend you watching it. By watching this video, you will run three times faster. But I do just want to say guys, this game is about just running fast. The game is about running fast without running out of stamina. There's also other stuff in the game. It's just not about running, as you guys already know. There's hurdles, relays, dash, high jump. I'm going to be showing you guys how to become a pro in all of these. So first things first guys, what you want to do is always look at what the next event is going to be. Let's say that the next event is going to be a 200 meter dash. What you want to do is basically just rinse all of your stamina. But if it is a long race, like a 1600 meter run, you want to run fast as well as saving your stamina. It's kind of hard to explain guys, but you basically want to run fast, but do not use up all of your stamina. You want to find the balance in between like I do. And yeah, by doing these methods guys, you'll just become a pro. So if you did watch my other video that I did just tell you to watch where you run faster, you will be able to win any dash. So if it's a 60 meter dash, 200 meter dash. 400 meter hurdles, you'll be able to win all of these, like it's nothing guys, 100 meter dash, you'll be able to win every single one of these like I do, but unfortunately guys, if it's a longer run, then you just need to use your brain and don't use all of your stamina, because if you use up all of your stamina, you're just going to lose guys, because if you run out of stamina, you're just going to be walking, and once all of your stamina is gone, you can't just get it back, you're just going to be walking guys. So you really want to concentrate on your stamina when you are running long distances. Now guys, if you want to run quickly, like I did say, watch my other video, I did explain how you can run three times faster, but what a lot of people are using is controller. So what you want to basically do guys, is on controller, instead of pressing left, right, left, right, what you want to basically do is press both of them at the same time. So on computer, you need to press E and Q. And on mobile, you need to tap the screen. But what you want to do, guys, basically, instead of pressing E, then Q, E, then Q, you want to just press it both at the same time, guys. And by just pressing it at the same time as fast as you can, you'll be able to run really, really quickly. But a lot of people are using controller because it's the best method to run as of right now. So if you have a controller, I highly recommend you using it. And obviously, guys, when you're in a race, I highly recommend you staying to the left. Stay as far as you can to the left, because the more further out you are, the more longer it is to go around. So the closer you are to the left side of the track, the more easier it is to win, pretty much. So yeah, just try to stay as far left as possible. And by just following those tips, you should be able to win every single game. Thank you for watching, and peace out.